We're at Harps waiting on Drew. He's late. So it's not our fault. Randall, get back here, man. Good morning. <laughs> <laughs> Good morning. This is Randall. What's your channel name? Gypsy Trails. Yeah. And you're here in Arkansas, what, for the fun of it? Yeah, just for the fun of it. Cool. Uh, just an adventure and know a bunch of people out here, wanted to meet a bunch of people, and she insisted. Yeah. And that's Gypsy. This yeah. This is goofball. Hi, Gypsy. That's yeah. the Gypsy that Gypsy <laughs> Trails is named after. All right, what are we doing today? Uh, we're helping Jim, and, uh, Jen and Wiley get moved into their new place, right? Yeah, yeah. Thanks for coming along. Odd. And Happy we got Gumby here. Gumby! Damn it. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't say it. <laughs> I said it. <laughs> if they can say it on TV, I can say it. <laughs> no kidding. Yeah. Hell, the, you, yeah, anyway. Yeah, Saturday Night Live. That's where we got it from. <laughs> it's early, the sun's in my eyes. I'm not a morning person, but we're gonna get some McDonald's and uh, I'll try to keep you up uh, as we progress through the day. We're waiting Gypsy's on Drew. Gypsy's ready to go. We're waiting on Drew as usual. <laughs> yeah, but go check out Randall, Gypsy Trails, uh, small channel, you're just getting started, kind yeah. of. Yep, yep, uh, I started like in November, but it's just been, you know, I'm just letting it, do its thing organically. All I right. Guess. And what kind of content are they going to find on Gypsy Trails? No, it's Trails? a hodgepodge. It's mostly it's mostly her antics. Um, yeah. But then we travel around. Like we were just down in Arizona. We we live in the, in my camper. We just travel. Beautiful. Yeah. That's so what we lots do. of adventures and meeting other people and yep, seeing exactly. the sights and exactly. All yep. right, Gypsy Trails. Say later, Gypsy. Nope. Might be tilted a little bit i'm not a good youtuber and that is evidenced by my lack of video from friday and saturday it is now sunday i am jeff i'm at the current well i called the groovy eggs farm when i moved here but uh yeah it's almost dark hopefully the chickens are going to bed soon I did not get much footage of Friday and Saturday, but they were two exciting days, so I'm gonna sit here and tell you about them. Yeah, Friday morning, uh, left here at 7 a.m., went next door, picked up Gumby from uh, Junk Gems Homestead. We headed to Harps and Waldron, where we met Randall from uh, Gypsy Trails. He's hanging out in Arkansas with us for a while. And we met Drew from Drew's Lens and Drew's Lens Reacts. 
And from there we headed, it was about a three and a half, three and a half hour drive time. It took a little over four hours or a little less than four hours, I think. But the uh, three of us kind of caravaned over to Oklahoma to Jen and Wiley's place, our mountain home, working with Wiley. And we had a big old caravan. Um, uh, once we got there, Mike and Lissa from Drifting Dreamers 5, they were there. Of course, Jen and Wiley were there. Uh, Biddy Boo Brown, she was uh, there. She's from uh, Oklahoma, so uh, she was part of the caravan. Jen had a great lunch, some fajitas uh, waiting for us. And uh, we got there right, right about noon, a little bit after noon. The, the idea was to get out of there by one. But as you saw with some of those clips, uh, yeah, uh, you know, little stuff happens and it takes longer. It always takes longer than what you think it will. Um, uh, you forget a lock for your hitch and uh, so you can't just pull it out. Uh, so then you got to take the ball off and change that out if you want a different size ball. So that took some time and uh, but we got loaded up. Mike and Alyssa from DD5 left early and they had some car issues. Uh, you can check that all out on their channel. They made it home though. It was all right. And then uh, so they took off ahead of us. Uh, I actually they were at my place. They unloaded their trailer at my place. And I got to my place just as they were leaving. I took a little shortcut to get there earlier than everybody else. So, um, but yeah, caravan of seven vehicles. Um, uh, Gary uh, Gumby Junk Gems rode up the, over there with me and he drove the school bus back. So uh, it was uh, Gary and the school bus. We had uh, Wiley pulling a big trailer with one of their uh, buses on it uh jen was driving their minivan pulling a trailer uh biddy boo brown was pulling the um uh log splitter i hooked up a trailer to mine and hauled it back they had like an old truck bed that was converted that wiley converted to a trailer and that's the first time i've ever towed a trailer over long distance i mean i've driven them you know less than 30 miles an hour up and down the road less than a mile but so that was yeah and my toyota did just fine i got about i got i usually get 16 miles per gallon and the trip was i was like 14.2 miles per gallon but half of that trip was normal and the other half was with the trailer so it, not too bad with the trailer on it. it wasn't all that heavy uh so that's five of us we had randall from gypsy trails and uh drew from Drusland's React. So that was the seven of us in a caravan. Uh, it took about five hours. We left about three o'clock, got to my place about 8 p.m. And um, it, right as it was getting dark, we were there a little after 8 p.m. actually, uh, right at dark. So camped out at my place um, and then went back at it on Saturday. <laughs> Yeah, Friday night, they just uh, parked everything at my place. And then uh, I didn't get there until Saturday afternoon. But uh, uh, Drew was back out there. Uh, Gumby was back out there. And uh, Biddy Boo Brown, um, she, uh, she's she got her little vehicle to stay in. And so she was out there. Um, and I went back out there. They had some other friends from Oklahoma come on Saturday too. But so Saturday, they were just using Drew's backhoe unloading their buses and whatnot and using boat uh drew's backhoe to pull it back onto their property and that took uh that took yeah a lot of the day on saturday i didn't get there till the afternoon so i am not a good youtuber 
I did not get great footage. I'm thinking, well, what I did uh, yesterday on Saturday was I grabbed other people's cameras. You know, they're out there working hard. And uh, so I grabbed their cameras and did some film for, filming for them. So uh, some of my camera work will show up in some of these videos, just not mine. Uh, yeah, just a few clips from, from Saturday. Um, and it's, uh, yeah, they, you know, you go with the flow. Uh, we had that big rain. And so they had a muddy situation over there. So they didn't get everything where they wanted it to go right off the bat. And they'll, you know, they're, uh, 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 they're good people. They'll just work around it and get to it when they can get to it. So, all right, that is the story of Jen and Wiley's big move day from Oklahoma to Arkansas. And they still have stuff to go back and get. They're not selling their land in Oklahoma. They're hanging on to that. It's going to stay in the family. Um, so they're in no time pressure or anything. Uh, as far as, uh, you know, moving stuff they don't need right away. But, yeah, so that's the scoop on them. And everybody was helping with that. So uh, the toilet works. That was helpful that we have a toilet. So people had facilities to use when they were helping Jen and Wiley. And, um, and water, to The water in the bathroom sink. Well, the cold water in the bathroom sink works. But, yep. Uh, still no electric plumbing. Uh, they fiddled with the kitchen sink plumbing for a little bit. Uh, but anyway, yeah, no clue when folks will be available again. All right, but go check out Jen and Wiley's channel, Our Mountain Home, and working with Wiley. Our Mountain Home is their main channel, and they're, it looks like she's going to try to do a daily vlog, you know, just quick uh, updates. You know, they're off grid. <laughs> And uh, I don't even get a cell signal out there, so I don't know how they're going to do it. But, yeah, you definitely want to get in on the ground level as our mountain home builds their homestead in Arkansas. All right, that was just a lot of fun. You know, a big old convoy with uh, uh, a school bus and two small buses and, and, uh, and trailers and their food, their food trailer, their concession stand food trailer. Yeah, I'm excited to see them. Uh, and not just because they're my neighbors, but uh, especially because they're my neighbors. But this is going to be great. Thanks, everybody, who's been helping them out and all of us out. You guys are what's making this possible. If you don't watch our videos, we don't do them. And if we don't do them, we don't meet other people like Jen and Wiley and, and Junk the Gems and all that stuff. And so uh, you guys are a huge part of making this community happen. I think this is... Uh, they should do a, a documentary about us or something. This is just a special thing happening in this area of Arkansas the past few years. And uh, stick with us. I think it's going to be, uh, the, this is going to be a great year for this area. And uh, uh, meet up in May. Yep. Drifting Dreamers 5 has more info on that. Thanks for watching. Thanks for everything. Take it easy. Ha <laughs> ha